Good afternoon, Abdi and Moya. Hello. Hello. How are you? Good, good. All right. So I understand you have some questions about lead. Yes, we've been learning more and more about lead on children, how harmful it is. We just want to learn the important topics, effects of lead on children, and how we can prevent lead exposure at home. Very good questions and very important topics that we should definitely learn more about, particularly with lead poisoning and lead exposure. Lead poisoning occurs when lead builds up in the body, often over months or years. Even small amounts of lead can cause serious health problems. Children younger than six years are especially vulnerable to lead poisoning, which can severely affect mental and physical development. At very high levels, lead poisoning can be fatal. Initially, lead poisoning can be hard to detect. Even people who seem healthy can have high blood levels of lead. Signs and symptoms usually don't appear until dangerous amounts have accumulated. Signs and symptoms of lead poisoning in children include developmental delay, learning difficulties, irritability, loss of appetite, weight loss, sluggishness and fatigue, abdominal pain, vomiting, constipation, hearing loss, seizures, eating things such as paint chips that are not food. Lead poisoning can be prevented and avoided by keep children away from peeling paint and broken plastic. Be careful with your hobbies. Some crafts call for use of paint, glaze, and solder. Many of these may contain lead. Learn more about possible lead dangers while working on hobby. Don't bring lead home with you from work. People who work at construction, plumbing, painting, auto repair, and certain other jobs can be exposed to lead. Learn more about possible lead dangers while working on construction site. Do you have any other questions? No, thank you, doctor. Thank you, doctor. Are you very welcome. Uh, and uh, thank you for uh, this great questions you had today. And uh, be sure to share with others what you have learned. Lastly, it's very important that you are following up with your doctor to make sure your child is receiving regular lead testing. If you have questions or concerns about possible lead exposure and to see what services may be available to your family, visit www.kingcounty.gov lead.